the real need, I think, uh, 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 Secretary Salabrisi would agree that the most urgent need is for remodeling and modernization of urban hospitals. We've done a great deal of uh, community hospital construction in suburban and rural communities. Uh, 100 million is the amount we've asked for for the last three years. Uh, it seems to me that the case is very weak for going up to 150. Now, I know that that is what uh, Senator Hill uh, uh, wants to do. Uh, and he may very well put it in anyway, even if, uh, uh, even if we don't uh, uh, ask for the, uh, I mean, even if we ask just for 100, he may move it up to 150. But in that case, he gets charged for it, not you. How much do we have in our budget for it? Uh, well, we had uh, we had a hundred for community hospitals and uh, fifty for uh, for modernization and remodeling of urban hospitals. So we had 150 altogether. Uh, now, if he puts a whole 150 on uh, uh, on the community hospitals and gives us nothing for remodeling, we come out even on the budget. But we have increased the community hospital program by 50 million. You see, he would not give us the, the modernization authority this year. The, the legislation gives it to us uh, for starting in 1966 and at a lower level than we requested. So he wants to deny us the right to modernize and take that money and uh, put the community hospital. That's right. It's, it's really a question, Mr. President, of, of, uh, of where the need is greatest. And I think everybody who studied it would agree that, that over the last 10 years, we've done a great deal of construction in suburban and rural areas. And the great need now is in modernizing uh, urban hospitals. Uh, that was the case that we made. The committee uh, uh, went along by uh, authorizing a small beginning in 1966, but they authorized nothing in, uh, in 1965. And they took the money we had in for modernization and put it into the old uh, uh, suburban and rural construction program.